Coach, this has got to feel completely different than last year. I know it was all kind of thrown together, but you guys are out here for a full season. Tell us about that. Yeah, it's exciting. We're just happy to be out here, like you said, and it's definitely different, but it is football at the end of the day, and uh, to have the opportunity to get these young men out here to compete and to fulfill their dreams, because a lot of their dreams were squashed last year, and this is a moment for them to seize that opportunity. They had it taken away, and they understand that now. We have a well-rounded group of people. I would say we like to run the ball, but we also could throw the ball. We have a couple really talented wide receivers and an excellent quarterback. And uh, we've this year been pretty balanced offensively. And I think if you asked us, what do you guys look at? You, your uh, best part is running the ball at this point, though. What do you think they learned the most from last year? Uh, you can't take anything for granted. That's the number one thing we talked about. And our takeaway every day is you got to take everything out of that day and take the best of it, the worst of it, and just just keep it there because it may not be there tomorrow. And we understand that if we don't work as hard as we can today, there might not be a day tomorrow to work harder. So why test it? Why even uh, pretend like it can't happen? Because we know it can happen at this point. AJ, tell me how long you've been playing football and why you chose it for your sport. I've been playing football for about like five years, but I was on and off. I've, I, pl I play football because I just love it every day, and I love the coaches here, and yeah. Okay, and then you're you're the quarterback, is that right? Yeah. Have you always played QB, or did you play other positions? No, I played Pop Warner as a wide receiver in D-end, and then um, they needed a quarterback my freshman year, and I stepped in and been the quarterback ever since. Okay, what do you think that you learned from year to year to get a little bit better at your own game? Um, or what do you work on? Yeah, uh, I, like I work alone a lot, and I like take a lot of pride in that, and um, like just, in the weight room or yeah in the weight room and off the like on the field with like coaches and yeah, private coaches and I bring a couple guys out here a lot and just throw every day and yeah all right and then what's the message that your coach always wants you to remember <sighs> probably just to give it your all every day and never regret anything after football just all, yeah tell me how long you've been playing football and why you chose it for your sport uh, this is my fourth year playing football I'm a senior in high school and uh, I played all four years at Peninsula, and I played football because my friends got me too. Okay, did you ever pl ever play any other sports or? When I was younger, I played a lot of different sports like soccer, basketball. I did play some football when I was younger, but it was only like flag. And so, uh, I guess I kind of chose football to play in high school just because I wanted to pick one sport to get good at. I guess. Okay, what do you work on from season to season in your your own game, whether it's weightlifting or what have you, to get a little better? I try to learn football a lot better. Uh, I don't actually like football a lot on like uh, on Sundays and stuff. Okay. I tend to only think about football when I'm on the field, and uh, I guess that's what I work on. What position do you play? I play linebacker and wing. Okay. Now, did you always play wing and line, or did you have you moved around a little bit? <laughs> I uh, I used to play uh, offensive line and defensive line. Wow. But uh, I currently moved to linebacker and wing. Do you like that better? I love it. What, what do you What do you like the most about those positions? I like linebacker and wing because I feel like I get to be a lot more agile on the field. I get to, I, I think I get to show off my athleticism a lot more. And uh, I think I just get to be a more important part of the field. Okay. Not saying that any position is more important than the no. other. No. I think everybody sort of feels like they settle into an area, so that's interesting that you say that. Mason, tell me how long you've been playing football and why you chose it for your sport. Um, I've been playing football for as long as I could remember. It's um, My brothers played, so I've kind of always just grown up into it. What positions do you play? Uh, I play running back and corner. Now, did you always play the same positions, or did you kind of move around a little bit? Um, I've kind of always played running back, but uh, uh, corner was kind of a new thing just coming into high school, just looking for someone to play the position, and I've uh, started playing. What was that like learning defense when you were used to being an offensive player? Um, it just kind of came easy. When you play offense, you kind of know the play, so you kind of just adapt to it pretty easily. You kind of know what's coming in the other direction. Yeah, in a sense. Okay. And then um, why do you think you chose football? Were there other sports that you tried? or? Uh, I've tried. or My parents like to put me in all different sports. So I've played just about everything. But I, football is like the only one that stuck okay. pretty well. It yeah. was, was there any particular reason? Is it just the, the camaraderie with guys? Or is it a physical thing? Or what do you think it is? I, I just love the guys. I love being here. It's kind of just different from everything else. 
I started freshman year here. I just played because I, I played hockey before, and so I, li I really liked hitting people. And all my friends played, so I'm like, oh, why as well try it, you know? So that's really why I played. What do you think the difference between hockey and football are? The running. Yeah? Running and skating is a bit different. Yeah, yeah. it is. But it, it seems like it, it, they're both really physical kind of games. Yeah, that's why, that's why I like to play both. Okay. Um, do you still play hockey? or? No, not anymore, sadly. I stopped my junior year okay. playing. Yeah. And what position are you playing here? I'm a running back in a corner. Okay. And so is that? did you kind of settle into that position? Did you try other positions? or? I was. I was a tight end freshman year. Okay. I, I don't know why. I'm pretty small. But <laughs> I was a tight end freshman year. And then I also played corner freshman year. And then sophomore year, I got moved to running back, and I just sticked with there, you know, for the rest of the year. Your coach says that one of the one of the positives on the team is the running, so you must take a lot of pride in, in doing that correctly. Yeah, yeah, it's really fun. <laughs> okay, um, wh what do you sort of work on from one season to another to get a little better in your own game? Just lifting weights, running more. Okay. And I, I surf a lot to stay in shape, so okay. I do a lot of that too. Uh, I've been playing football since my freshman year, and it's a sport I've always loved watching growing up, and I would just. I was really excited for the opportunity to play it myself. Did you try other sports, or was this just the one uh, you I wanted? played baseball a lot growing up, and I wrestle as well. Okay. And what positions are you playing here? Uh, I'm playing linebacker and then um, some wing back on offense and then special teams as well. Have you always played those positions, or are you kind of uh, No, I played corner and receiver my freshman year, but I moved to these last year as sophomore. Do you feel like these are the right positions? Are you comfortable playing yeah, this I'm, now this year? I like where I'm playing right now. Okay. Sure. Well, what do you tend to work on from season to season to get a little better? Uh, my footwork is something that I've been trying to work on a lot. It was lacking a bit as I was younger, and I think that's something I've improved on and just continuing to improve on. All right, and, and how did you sort of deal with the season being cut very short last year and then coming into this year? Uh, it was unfortunate last year with, you know, not getting to play the full season. We got five games in, and we had some success in the, with the Frost off JV. That's five games, and then um, just the quick turnaround was kind of, it was nice. We got to stay in shape and stay with the team. I liked it. It was a short summer then, right? Yeah. Very okay. short. Okay, and then what's the message that your coach wants you to remember? Uh, love each other. If we play as a family, we're going to be good no matter what we do. Alex, tell me how long you've been playing football and why you chose it for your sport. This is my first year of playing football. And well, tell me why you decided you wanted to play. Well, I'm a senior now, so I try and get everything done that I've been wanting to do in my high school career. So football was on that list, and my parents finally let me play this year. So, Have you played other sports? I have. I, I play soccer and baseball. Okay, Those and what was it about football that it, it was on your list and you said, I, I want to conquer this? Just the intensity of playing football and seeing the family that um, I've been watching for three years on this field, uh, I just wanted to be a part of that. Okay, and what position are you playing? I'm kicker. Okay, and what are you working on specifically to get a little bit better at kicking? Just getting that same routine every single kick. That's those same steps, the same motion, same everything. Okay, you've been an athlete all of your life, it sounds like. Um, what do you think you've learned from other sports that help you out here? Um, the dedication. I think hard work is the most important thing in playing sports. If you don't work hard, you don't get better. So I think that really carried over into football. Having wanted to play as long as you did, um, did this live up to your expectation now being a part of this team? 100%. I couldn't have asked for a better better um, intro to the team and a better season so far. Um, I mean, I've been playing football pretty much my whole life since I was six. So um, just got into it at an early age. So it was easy to make that choice in high school. Okay, and what position do you play? I play safety uh, and, and wide receiver. Okay, so very physical positions on both sides. Um, did you always play those positions, or over the years have you been in different places? Um, early on, uh, like back in like middle school, I used to play like linebacker and you know DN and stuff like that. Uh, and I just got you know skinnier in high school, so switched positions then pretty okay. much. Okay, and then from from season to season, year to year, what have you kind of done to just to get get a little better in your own game? Oh, um, just working on my own. I like to I like to run a lot, so I do that pretty much outside of football. Uh, I play lacrosse on okay. the off season. Wow, something I picked up, and uh, that's a lot of fun. So uh, I just try to keep physical like year round, um, not drop off at all during the off season. What do you think that you learn from other sports that helps you out here on the field? Um, a lot of communication. Um, Got to be able to communicate with teammates. Uh, makes everything a lot easier. Um, being, being able to lead um, in tough situations, 
something I learned in, in both sports. So Okay. Super. And are you still playing lacrosse? Or? I am. Wow. Okay. And then um, what's the message that your coaches always want you guys to remember? Um, this year especially has been play for each other. There's been a lot of, um, you know, things out of our control that have kind of, uh, let's say, not helped us in, yeah. in, in winning games um, like COVID and stuff. So, uh, but they've always... Uh, all season so far it's been telling us to play for each other if we can do that then nothing really else matters uh, if we can get behind each other and support each other uh, I started playing football freshman year so that's, this is my third year and I started playing because I didn't make the basketball team here okay so I was like I'll play football just in case that doesn't work out and I actually really like it so it turned what, out for the better what is it that you love about this game I just love like the brotherhood and like the friendships I made because like I'll never forget these guys and We've always been together, so. Very true. Now, what position are you playing? I play O-line. Okay, and have you always played O-line? Yeah, yeah. Okay, and, and what have, uh, since you've been playing for a few years, what do you sort of work on from season to season to get a little bit better? Um, I think, well, I work in the off-season a lot, so okay. I'm always lifting weights, and I'm always doing field work, like uh, footwork drills and stuff, just to get faster feet. That helps me the most. Okay. I know that you guys had a very shortened season last year, but um, as I was talking to one of your teammates, because the summer was so short, it's like you guys have been pretty much playing the whole time, which is a benefit, I guess. Mm -hmm, yeah. Okay. And what's the message that the coaches want you guys to always remember? Um, just to work hard and give it all you got, and that'll, that'll work out for the better. Okay. And then how are you sort of balancing the school time with the sports time? Um, I, I like to get my work done beforehand, like on the weekends. Okay. So that helps a lot to free up time out to practice so I don't have to do, like, hours of homework at night. Got and it. get good sleep and rest. Yeah, <laughs> that's always very positive for sure. I've been playing football since eighth grade, and I just thought it was a fun thing to watch, and so I wanted to play it as well. Did you ever play any other sports? Yes, I've played basically every sport in the books. Okay, why do you think you wanted to play football so much when you're an all-around athlete? Uh, I don't know. The contact is very attractive. Okay. I like what hitting people. What position are you playing now? I play safety, quarterback, uh, wide receiver, and punter. Okay, well, safety, you're definitely hitting people for sure. Yes. That's, do you like one position over the other? or Definitely safety. Okay, all right. And um, how are you sort of balancing the school time with the football time? Um, barely. Okay. <laughs> That's a good answer. <laughs> I guess you have to just kind of be a good manager of time, huh? Yes. Okay. You get home, you do your homework right away. Okay. And what's the, um, what's the message that the coaches want you guys to remember? Oh, definitely, like, this is our family, and just to play for one another and be, like, a team player and doing everything you can to, you know, help the team. And what do you tend to work on from season to season to get a little bit better? Uh, for me, it's, like, conditioning and strength, but also, like, some of the f football aspects where it's, like, my throwing or, you know, my form on my tackles or something. I've been playing for about 10 years now. Wow. Um, ever since I was a kid and, uh Funny enough, one of the head coaches here, he used to coach here, Smith, uh, he invited my older brother to play Pop Warner. And then just as a result, I just kind of got pulled into it too as the little brother. So, And I've loved it ever since. I mean, it's free therapy. I mean, get to hit, be hit, play football, you know? Do, what position do you play? I play a middle linebacker. Do, have uh, you always played in the middle? or I've played middle or? linebacker for about eight years. Oh, the first wow. two, they had me at safety which was odd because I've always been short thicker <laughs> yeah but as long so, as you pass but it, it worked so just getting being a good manager of time it sounds like too mm -hmm. I try what are the messenger messages that the coaches want you guys to remember um there you go uh something that coach Campbell has always instilled in, uh, I remember even in Pop Warner this is the job as the coaches is to love us the players and our job as players is to love each other and I think that the message is really on and off the field is to be good men. I think that that's really some of the lessons that football teaches, the camaraderie, the work ethic. And I think that really learning to persevere through a lot of, a lot of challenges, really. And I think that a lot of that translates very well off the field as well, socially and physically. And I think that that mentality of, okay, if I can run miles in heavy gear in the boiling sun I can I can do a little bit more homework like it's 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 really a, a mental game it's really a mental game and I think having that strong mental is a large part of it and I think that's what they're instilling in us and I think 
I think there's a bunch of fine young men out here. How long have you been playing football, and why did you choose it for your sport? Uh, I think like eight years. Okay. Did you ever play any other sports or? Uh, basketball and soccer. Okay. Did you like football the best or? Yeah. Okay. What do you think that you learned from the other sports that help you in football? Um, athleticism. Okay. And maybe being a part of a team or, and w what do the coaches always want you to remember? Um, it's a team sport. Okay. And then how do you sort of balance the school time with the sports time? Uh, playing ahead. I've been playing football for four years and um, I decided to choose it because I've tried a lot of sports in the past and I thought that it might be fun so when I entered high school I decided to give it a try and I ended up playing for all four years. What do you think made you stick with it? Um, I just thought like the sense of family was really great. It's, it was unlike any other sport I'd ever been a part of um, in the past and just the work ethic was really something that inspired me to do better especially um, with school because there's difficult classes all the time mm -hmm. so um, having such a good work ethic presented to me um, in high school I think was really important so that's why I decided to stay. What positions did you play? Um, I play wide receiver and safety. And did you always play those positions or were you moved around a little bit? Um, I was always a wide receiver and I started out playing cornerback um, and then recently I got moved to safety um, but pretty much the same same uh, assignments. Okay and from season to season what did you sort of work on in the off time to get a little bit better? Um, in the off season uh, mainly conditioning um, and in between like periods of training uh, strength uh, strength and conditioning was really big um, and then there was always time to work on like footwork and um, hands like catching uh, so those were probably biggest things for position like mine. Alright Kyle, tell me how long you've been playing football and why you chose it for your sport. Uh, I've been playing football at Penn for four years. Um, oh my gosh, I'm sorry. That's okay, take a minute. Uh, take a minute. I gotta think. Okay. <laughs> Did you play other sports? Yeah, lacrosse. Okay. And why do you think you stuck with this one? Um, I don't know. I just really enjoyed football. It's not like just a sport. There's like a lot of dedication and commitment. And it really just teaches me and all of us. We can just tell. We're all like dedicated and we show up here every day, work our ass off. Yeah. What, what position do you play? Uh, I play safety and receiver. Okay. Did you always play those or have you moved around a little bit? Um, I played that all my four years at Peninsula. Do you prefer to play offense or defense or do you like the mixture of both? Um, I enjoy defense more but I definitely have fun on offense too. Okay and what's the message that the coaches want you guys to remember? Um, hard work, that's all they teach us. Okay. Out here every day four hours grinding, gotta love it. You gotta love it for sure. How do you sort of balance the school time with the football time? Um, it's a grind but you know once you get into it Start working on your homework and then just right after practice, be a good manager. Squeezing of time. by. Uh, well, I've been playing tackle football ever since freshman year. I chose it because I've been a Steelers fan since I was a little kid and uh, I like to hit people, I guess. Okay, did you ever play any other sports? Um, I do some jujitsu and MMA kind of stuff okay. outside of school, but with football, I kind of prioritize it. So, staying off that for a little bit, but not want to get hurt. That's kind Interesting. What yeah. have you learned from, from martial arts that helps you on the field? Uh, well, definitely the physical part of it. You know, you're still t taking guys down and being physical, but also the respect of it mm -hmm. because it's, it's very different in martial arts. Yeah. You know, you're getting your butt kicked all the time. You have to respect everybody. And I feel like that helps transfer over to the field so you don't get too emotional or too uh, out of your head. Okay. Because you've been playing football for a while now, what do you sort of work on from season to season to get a little better? Uh, always weight room footwork, um, the mental game, just learning how to beat coverages and learning how to play coverages and scouting out other teams and trying to get better every season. Okay, and um, how do you sort of balance the school time with the football time? Oh man, yeah, that's a hard one. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> um, try to balance it by, you know, try to limit my phone time, try to limit how much I'm on my uh, screens and all that. Just try to keep everything to a balance, try to track everything. So 
keep time management. That, yeah, that's an important yeah. thing. <laughs> okay, and then um, what's the messages that the coaches want you guys to remember? You know, always work hard. Don't give up. It's like it's Peninsula. We're never the biggest, fastest, strongest team, but we always have the most grit. You know, never stop trying. Just keep going out there every day and trying to be the best. Seamus, tell me how long you've been playing football and why you chose it for your sport. Uh, this is my third year playing football, and coming in freshman year, I just wanted something to do. And I found out I really love the game, and it's a great group of guys you get to play with. It's just an amazing experience overall. And did you ever try any other sports? or? Uh, I also play lacrosse. Oh, it's so interesting. There's a couple of your teammates that play lacrosse. Yeah, there's a good amount of us that do. What do you think that you learn from lacrosse that actually helps you on the football field? Uh, you just learn, like, you get a lot closer with your teammates that play both, so you can learn to trust them more. And it's a lot of uh, conditioning in both sports, so that correlates with both of them. Do, are the seasons the same or are they different? No. Uh, lacrosse is in the spring, so it keeps you in shape for football, which is great. Okay, well, that answers my question of what do you do in the off season to stay yeah. in shape, but that's what you do. Okay, and then um, how do you sort of balance the school time with the football time? Uh, it is hard, but if you just take advantage of like your free time on your weekends and when you don't have classes and stuff, it makes it a lot easier. Okay, and then what's the messages that the coaches want you guys to remember? Uh, that working hard will help you succeed a lot and that dedication is very important to everything you do. How long have you been playing football and why did you choose it for your sport? Uh, this is actually my first year playing football. Yeah, I just came into the program and uh, I knew a lot of people in it, some good guys, so I thought it'd be fun to hop in. Did you ever play any other sports? Uh, I, I played ice hockey my whole life. Wow, okay, so it's such a physical game. Why did you want to try football after playing ice hockey? <laughs> so uh, Corona, you know, a lot, of, a lot of things like that, it really, um, uh, ended the experience of hockey. You know, it was hard to it was hard to get out there and travel with everything going on. True. So um, I just I talked to a friend over here and he said hey, you should try it out and I'm glad I did. It's a great time. Yeah. What positions they have you playing? I'm um, a defensive end. Okay. Yeah. And so how I mean since this is your first year, is it everything that you thought it was going to be or what what has the experience been like so far? Yeah, coming in it was more uh, for fun. Okay. Like you just uh, you know see have to have something to do, but uh, I've really found some brothers out here, some people to. You know, be able to talk to and be cool with. So, yeah, I'm glad I did it. Okay, and f I mean, football is so time consuming. How do you sort of balance the school time with the football time? Yeah, it, uh, once I get out, you know, it's pretty much right away doing homework until I sleep. So, it's a lot of, it's time consuming for sure, but it, it ends up being worth it. Okay, and do you guys <laughs> do a lot of things off the field together as well? Yeah, I, I, I mean, uh, at school, at lunch, you know, we'll all be hanging out before school. Pretty much all the time we're together. So, okay. Yeah. That's pretty cool. And then, um, what's the messages that the coaches want you guys to remember? Um, he, uh, he repays hard work for sure. You know, he always makes sure that you feel appreciated if you're putting in the work, if you're putting in the effort, he'll give it to you. And, uh, he really, yeah, he just pushes you in that way. Just kind of making sure you are always giving it your all. Caleb, tell me how long you've been playing football and why you chose it for your sport. Um, it's been three years. I started as a freshman. I'm a junior now. I chose it as my sport because I was watching it growing up. And I mean, I'm a little big for track and stuff. So this kind of fit well. Did you ever try any other sports or? Oh, I do. I do wrestling and shot put. Oh, okay. I actually, I shouldn't say shot put. It got closed down for COVID, but I want to try it. Okay, and so, but you wrestle as well. Yeah. Okay, and so, um, since you've been playing football for a couple of years, what do you sort of do, um, to keep in conditioning and get better over the years? Uh, lots of running and lifting. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right, and then um. What position do you play? I'm center. Center. Okay. Have you always played center? or? Did yeah, I've always played okay. center. So specific to that, you obviously have to work with the quarterback a lot. Mm -hmm. So is that something that you do off the field as well? Or I mean in... Uh, sometimes we have... I'm an offense position. Okay. So on like defense days when it's mostly focused on defense, I'll work with him. We just snap and go over plays and stuff like that. Okay. Perfect. That's yeah. Because I mean mm -hmm. that's a very specific position, yeah. obviously. So okay. And um, what's the messages that the coaches want you guys to remember? Uh, don't quit. Always give your best. Just stay with it. Okay. When things suck, just push through. Good message for sure. Mm -hmm. And then how do you sort of balance the school time with the football time? It's hard. Because I, I have stuff on top of that I have to balance too. But I guess just try and not always distract yourselves with other things like video games, your phone. Just try and get that all out of the way and everything. It pays off. Um, I've been playing football uh, since fr my freshman year of high school. I, I chose it. My parents didn't let me play uh, tackle in middle school. They let me 
do it in high school, and I'm really glad I did. It's been a great experience. Um, but yeah, I've been f about four years now. What position do you play? Um, I play um, mainly O line and D line. Okay. You know. And did you ever play any other positions, or mostly the line? Mo mostly on the line, yeah. Okay. What do you sort of work on from season to season to get a little bit better? Um, I try to work on my explosiveness and my, you know, aggressiveness, getting off the ball. Um, also, my speed. My speed also is a very big thing that I work on, and my endurance as well. Okay. If I want to go both ways, so right. yeah. Okay. And then, um, what do you sort of do in the off season when you're working? Uh, as far as like the mental part of the game, like how do you sort of compartmentalize that? Like, what do you sort of work on that ha helps you to focus? Um, in the off season, I mean, you just gotta stay, in the off season. You gotta stay focused. You can't mess around because off season is where you help, where you get stronger in the weight room. Yes. Build up your strength so you could you know duke it out in the season. So okay. That's I just m m focus on be you know lifting really heavy weights and then you know um, yeah just working hard in off season. All right. How do you sort of balance the school time with the football time? Um, it's it, it can be difficult with yeah. the you know six periods a day, but um, you just have to you know right when you get home you can't like you know st go off doing something else because you're gonna get you know distracted by that. You have to stay focused on your schoolwork and you know as a student athlete it's not not easy. You have to mm -mm. you have to really get into the books as well because you can't play if you you know don't have any, those grades. So. Howdy, tell me how long you've been playing football and why you chose it for your sport. Uh, I play, I've been playing football for uh, all four years of high school, and I chose it as a sport because mainly because my friend told me to play, and I kept playing it because uh, I felt really welcome in the family, and I really enjoyed being a part of the team. Okay, did you ever play any other sports? I played basketball before this. Oh, okay. What do you think that you've learned from basketball that helps you in football? Uh, I would say probably uh, my feet movement, like just moving my feet. It's much easier to move laterally, like especially on the line when you have to move left and right to try to block on oncoming rushers. And on what position do you play? I play offensive guard and defensive end. Okay, did you always play those positions or have you moved around a little bit? I've always been on the offensive line and defensive line. Okay, what do you sort of work on from season to season to get a little bit better since you've been playing for a while? I mainly, for defense, I mainly like to work on uh, making my hands better, making my hands faster so I'm able to get past off, uh, the offensive linemen. Okay. As well as for offense, I just want to work on staying low and keeping my hands, uh, and shooting my hands faster. and mainly getting stronger in the weight room. Okay, and then um, you've been doing this for your whole four years of high school. How do you sort of balance the school time and the football time? It takes a lot of work, you know, just you gotta put your mind to it, you know, like you leave your home at like six in the morning, you get back at seven at night, and you have like four hours of homework, but yeah. if, if you have the passion for what you do, you have to do it. All right, coach, um, are you rooting for the Chargers or the Rams this year? Uh, I'm a Chargers fan more than a Rams fan. I think I've said that before, <laughs> yes, but, yeah. but I've watched both equally. But I'll be honest, I'm a Raider fan, and I love what Derek Carr is doing right now. Uh, I got to go with the Rams just because got to represent our California, LA Rams. There you go. Go Rams. <laughs> I'm a Philadelphia Eagles fan. Wow, fly Eagles fly, huh? Yep. I don't really have a favorite, but if I had to choose, I'd choose the Rams. I've been brewing born and brewing bred, brewing till the day I'm dead. Rams, Chargers, or somebody else? Who's your oh, favorite? Rams all the way. Okay, so you just told me that you're a huge Steelers fan. So, any favorite players or? Uh, well, of all time, Heinz Ward. He got me into it. He's part Korean, so I had to so support him. And that's why I got into the Steelers. Uh, probably I'd have to say I'm actually a New York Giants fan, so it's kind of kind of tough. Uh, I like the Packers. Ah, okay, Green Bay. Mm, probably, probably Rams. Yeah. Big Rams guy, yeah. Okay, AJ, who's your favorite pro team? Is it Rams, Chargers, or somebody else? The Green Bay Packers. Um, my team is the Raiders. Yeah. I was just growing up, like, so my dad kind of taught me, so. Silver and black all the way. Yeah, absolutely. Ooh, I, uh, my parents are not from here, so, so I like the Cowboys and the Lions. Yes, the Cowboys. <laughs> I'm a Steelers fan, actually. My a mom, Steelers my fan? My mom grew up in Pittsburgh, so we've been Steelers fans our whole life. I'm a Jaguars fan, actually. I don't know. I just I liked their logo when I was younger, okay. and I was like, oh, they look cool. I'm a Packers fan. <laughs> I guess the Rams. It's yeah. my It's my family's team. Um, I'd probably have to say the Rams. Um, yeah, just stick to LA. Steelers all the way. There are a lot of Steeler fans on this team. Are there really? Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, you after you watch the video, you're gonna find out.